What's going on guys? Big Turkey on Weed here. Bring you another blitz today. And this is actually going to be out of multiple formations in the New York Jets playbook. Um, this can be done in any 3-4 playbook, but basically I ran into this all weekend league long and uh, wanted to find out how to do it. Um, it comes out of two plays and basically it's out of the bear and the 3-4 come. And what it is, is if you look at the three down linemen, the 97, 72, and 90, they're in the both, both in the same formation on both uh, formations, or they're in the same position in both formations. And in other formations, you can see they're a little bit more spread out. And this creates a lot of congestions in the middle and basically pops one to two linemen free instantly, almost on every single play. So the first thing we're going to look at is we'll look at the three, four cl club cover to press. And we'll run this against, just so you see how quick it is, we'll run this against, we can just, uh, we'll do bunch first. Because obviously that's what a lot of people like to come out in. So the setup for this blitz is to uh, pinch your lineman down. Actually, I should start over. This has to come from the right side. So you see how the play, I have to flip this play. So originally, Jalen Smith here was the one blitzing. But the blitzing linebacker has to come from here. So we'll start it off that way. Then you pinch down, crash your line like this, like so. QB contain, and then spy the right outside linebacker. The end of the play, it's going to look something like this. And on offense, when you snap the ball, somehow they just glitch out and multiple players can come free. And when you're in ultimate team mode and you have fast linemen, guys like Lawrence Taylor playing in these positions, people just aren't going to have a chance. Um, now, what I want to show you secondly is what this is versus a blitzing running back. So, we pinch him down, QB contain, and it looks like this, and then we spy that outside linebacker. On offense... We'll block the running back. That blocked running back still is not going to contain the lineman. It's almost always two people. At the worst case, it's one person. The blitz just comes in way too effectively. And with it coming out of the 3-4 cub, you can run a lot of coverages behind it. So what we'll show next is we'll choose a new play and show that this can also come out of the cover 3. And this can also come out of cover four. I have not had just as, as much luck when I run man defense behind it. So we're going to come out and cover three this time. And on the same token, we will come out and bunch. Since it's cover three this time, we don't have to flip our defense. The blitz is, still, is now coming from the right of uh, stock. So we pinch our lineman down. Crash, QB contain, and we'll QB spy our outside linebacker. On offense, not the ball, and you get the same result. That time, one person got through. Every single time, basically, somebody's getting through. Um, it's something that is just a glitch out in the game. Hopefully, they patch it sometime soon. But I want everyone to, to be able to know about this blitz. Um, just so you know what you're seeing and what you're finding out. I'm also going to actually show you how to block this blitz. Or how I've found to be the most effective blocks for this blitz. Again, two people coming through instantly. And with you're going to have uh, eight people in coverage behind. That makes this just very difficult. You're going to have to scramble. You're going to have to have guys. And you're going to contain one side of the field. It, it's almost unfair, really. Um, it's a very frustrating blitz to play against. Obviously, I found that out this weekend. Like I lost multiple games because of this blitz. So we'll go to choose a new play, and I want to show you that it works also out of four, out of three, four bear. We come down, and we'll come out in three, four bear. And on this one, we'll come out in cover three. And on offense. We'll come out in bunch again. And with cover three, we don't have to flip the play. I don't believe we have to flip the play. 
We'll find out. But I don't think you have to flee. We'll set the blitz up. And we get the same thing. You see that little shift? It's very frustrating. That's, that's what the most frustrating thing is. Is when you when you have this, uh, it's the lineman literally stepped to the flinch out to the side. Like it's a it's a literal glitch in this game. So we'll pinch down. At the ball. Oh, they didn't blitz out that time. So I've found this to be able to change up the coverages to be most unique in the 3-4 cup. That's probably my favorite way to run this blitz. Um, but now I want to show you how to stop it. Or not really stop it, but slow it down. This is the best ways that I've found to slow it down. So if we come out and come, and we'll come out and cover three so we don't have to flip the play. A lot of things that you're going to look at is you'll look at uh, people are going to be like, oh, well, you have to identify. You have to uh, block tight end, block a running back. None of those things are what you want to do. Um, what you actually want to do is slide your line to the right. I always try to slide my right line to my receivers or tight ends. And I found that this has been a pretty good way of blocking the play. So we'll set it up, inch, and we'll see if it stops it here. And it doesn't always block it, but it, it, it's had some success for me. And we don't glitch out. Um, so when you're seeing this blitz, the main thing is I want you to know how to run it. Um, and then I also want you to know what to do to stop it. Uh, that's the biggest thing is to have an understanding so that when you see this blitz, because if you don't, um, you really don't stand a chance. You just, and I'll do the blitz again, just so you know that it's, uh, it's working. You know, I got it set up there and I don't side my line and we just glitch. They just glitch crazy. So when I slip my line, we'll start, try sliding my line one more time. Just to, just to show that it actually does work. Let's just set up. Offense is L1. Slide right. Bat the ball. These are the best ways. This has been the best way to find uh, that I've found to block it. So there you have it, guys. Uh, I give you the... That's probably the best blitz of uh, this weekend league that's, that's going to come out. And you're going to see a lot of people coming out showing you how to do it. Uh, out of both the 3-4 bear and 3-4 cub. Uh, if you see that from your opponent, you now know how to block it as well, and you'll be able to run it and add it to your defense. Uh, obviously, if your opponent does not know how to block it, it'll have a high benefit to you. So, I appreciate you guys watching the video. Uh, please like and subscribe for more content, and I hope you enjoyed. Bye.